right, welcome back to your Balanzai Dr. Liti Mende. Good morning, Ninja Show. Now, time for us to meet this Kajad guest, especially for all you mothers, or rather, um, intended mothers to be, or existing mothers. Now, to maybe now you get belay. Yes, this particular one now for you because you will learn betterment from this guest. So we get inside the house. Join me, welcome Joanne Sojinu. 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 Yeah. I'm into the house, and she now the author of A Mother's Prayers. Good to have you in the house. Thank you very much. Now, first of all, looking at this book, I see and say you get a lot of information, especially for mothers, um, intending mothers. Whether I say you, yeah, and you they plan to get belay, or whether I say you get belay, and this particular book would be very, very useful for you. I just want to know, why this book? Because I thought it would be nice to have something out there for mothers to have to, to use as a resource to pray through their children. And what I've done is that I have researched the development of a child from conception to birth. And at each stage, I have described what is happening in the womb and to the child and how, you know, what part is being developed. And then there's a prayer. Mm, I like that. Um, each stage, um, you, they describe what they happen and they for happen. inside the belly. So yeah. why is it important for you to they pray for your for your Peking way day for Bele. Why not wait until they come out? Why is it good for you to pray for them? Because it's good to, to pray, to actually speak positive words to your pregnancy, to your child, even before they're born. It's, it's, it's very effective. It's like a prophecy that you're prophesying over your child. And um, at some stage of the pregnancy, when the child begins to hear, has can hear you talk, he hears. The child hears the prayers. What stage as well. is that? <laughs> it's probably around the tenth week. Wow. Yeah. So from the tenth week, you're beginning to hear the prayers. You don't hear. Pray. Yeah. You don't hear you. Everything you say, you don't hear. I like that. Now, which which um, week they very very crucial in the life of a mother? Where they expect? I would say the first three, the first three months. So up to the first trimester, really, the first. Yeah, the first trimester, I would say, will be the first three months of the pregnancy. It's very crucial because that is the development stage of the child where all the parts are being formed. That is the crucial part. And I think it's very important to pray. And I've said in the book that even if you, because sometimes you don't know that you're pregnant, mm. and, but if you're planning to be pregnant, pray into those weeks, in, use those prayers in advance so that it settles there with God. And then, um, yeah, yeah. Looking at this book, I see say you do a lot of research, especially as regards to um, expecting. Yeah. Now, would it be some of the do's and don'ts for pregnant women with the out there? Don't be afraid. Don't be afraid uh, of the pregnancy. Pre pregnancy is a beautiful time. It's a gift from God. It's very beautiful. And don't, don't take on the fears that you hear from people uh, or the old wives' tales that, oh, is this, is that, this is my experience, because that might not be your experience. Why don't you make yours a different one? Why don't you join faith in making it a good thing? Enjoy your pregnancy. You're only pregnant for, for, for nine, nine months. months. Yeah, 42 weeks, mm -hmm. maybe, if, you're not, if you don't give birth at the 30, 38th week, you know. So why not make it a beautiful time? Yeah. That fear is very, very important. It is very important. <laughs> a lot of women are that fear, um, neither they actually neither actually hold them really tight. Yes, yes. And I think these prayers are very beautiful. And as you pray them, they're very calming. Mm -hmm. They can calm you and they orient your thoughts into the di right direction, into a positive direction. Mm -hmm. And I think being afraid as well, can, the child can pick up on fear as well. At some point, they can pick it up. So it's good to be positive. So tell us about the distribution of this book. How people feel actually get them? Um, what platform is they available? Okay, so it's there on Amazon. Okay. Amazon, you can get the paperback on Amazon. And if you have a Kindle, um, if you have a Kindle um, device, you can order it from there as well. And so, yeah, in dollars. Okay, so what about in Nigeria? Where yeah, if you actually get them? They can, they can deliver it. They will deliver okay. it to you. Okay. Yeah. So just order it. Go to Amazon, www.amazon.com, and um, you can order it from there.
All right, so just look for A Mother's Prayers um, by Joanne Sijunu. And then um, if you actually order them online, according by uh, this one, a week by week devotional for your unborn child. This is very important. Say, once you know, say you don't carry belly, once you know, say you're expecting a beautiful baby, it's very good for you to start to speak positivity into the life of your bikini. And that's now why she actually do um, this particular book. Thank you so much, um, Joanne Sijonu, you're an author and also inspirational leader with a passionate about seeing people connected to and living their full potential. Yes. And thank you very much. Thank Apart you. Apart from writing this book, you get another thing you do, where you get in the pipeline? Um, I have some poems that I would like to to put on my website because I have a website as well called www.joannesworldofpearls.com. So soon I would be putting my poems online and they're very inspirational. They're sort of things, experiences, I personal experiences I've been through in life, how I've overcome and how I've allowed my faith to help me through mm. difficult times. So that will be available soon. So please visit our website. Thanks a bunch once again. Thank you very much. To enjoy more of this, our Ogonke videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.